G'day, Len here from LPR Toolmakers. I'm just going to show you how to set up a manual tapping head. Now, these tapping heads, which we sell, are only little ones. They'll do up to uh, 12 mil, 13 mil, half inch. They'll go from about one eighth to half inch or about three mil, two mil, actually two mil to 12 mil or 13 mil, depending on the size of the shank, all right? Now, so they'll also go in your mill, vertically or you can, the way they clamp you can also put them in your lathe and use them in your lathe in your tail stock all right but they're manual they don't have a clutch in them right so this is how you set these things up we've got a square jaw that goes in and out on these two um grub screws and that'll open that inside out so you just put your tap down there until your square falls down the bottom once it does that you just slowly just tighten it up a little bit that centralizes the tap once the tap's been centralized you can lock it into place underneath that's so nice and secure you put that up in your machine right and then what we do is of course we just tighten this up a little bit and that'll just lock the tap into place now, once that's been locked in place, you use, these are gun taps, by the way, especially special purpose for just doing tapped holes, right? But you need to have a reverse on your machine for these to operate properly. So you put a, the lowest speed you can on your mill or your lathe and use a bit of cutting oil. And once you've lined up, you drilled your holes out, put the tapping head in, take it down till it gets just through your hole. Um, quite honestly, don't let it go too far. But you'll actually see the quill take it down, so just grab all of it once it goes through, stop it, put it in reverse, and it'll come back up itself again. Now, exactly the same with your lathe. The difference with the lathe, you can use the same type of setup, but you just leave the quill free and you just take it forward like itself. Once it gets through to the depth of your tapping the hole, you just stop your lathe, put it in reverse, and your quill will come back backwards. All right, so these are these little tapping heads. We've got them in two morse and three morse, right? We actually do also sell gun taps. All right, so I hope that's a little bit of a, 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 an eye opener for you if you want to use a tapping head. Thank you.